Welcome to uh, another edition of Juice Reviews. Uh, what are we going to call this show? Because we've been calling it Newbie and the Beast, but Newbie and the Beast is the one where we do the, the actual reviews. What, what should we call this? I don't know. Yeah. Instagram. Uh, Have any ideas what you want? To yeah, Instagram. Uh, we're, we're on Instagram Live, by the way. So Instagram, if you got any ideas for the name of the show. So we're just going to call it Vapor93 uh, Juice Reviews, and we're going to do these on uh, we're gonna do these on Monday. So it's, uh, maybe Juice Review Mondays. How's that? Simple. All right. So um, uh, I'm Bobby. I'm Ashley. All right, and um, you see how I, remember in the last video I went like this? Give that gives her permission to speak. Speak. Speaking. So, <laughs> yeah, see, it works. It, it works grand. Uh, all right, so today we're going to be reviewing uh, Redwood E-Juice, uh, Redwood Premium E-Juice. Uh, here's a little menu that we made for them uh, because we're, we're carrying it at the shop. It's something that we've had at the shop for a couple of months and uh, I have a feeling that not too many people outside of California really know about it. It's a really, really cool line and I'm going to give you a little backstory on it. Um, the sales rep came into my shop. His name is the Unicorn. Have you ever met anybody named the Unicorn? I have not. No. <laughs> I haven't either. Still has yet to give us his real name, so it makes me think that he's a little bit shady, but he's a really, really cool guy. And uh, he came in and he's like, you guys got to carry this juice. This juice is the best. This juice is this, that, and the other. And I will never carry a juice without testing it. But this guy was so persistent. This guy was so good at being a salesman that I picked it up without even trying it. Um, so the flavor profiles, I'm going to go over that with you guys uh, as soon as we get into it. But first, uh, we are going to try... There you go. What's that one there? Cathedral. You're allowed to speak. Thank you. <laughs> uh, so the, yeah, this one's a Cathedral. This is their... Um, I guess this is their flagship uh, liquid right here. And uh, you can go over the, the flavor profile there. And Cathedral is a strawberry hibiscus with tangerine and cucumber. Yes. So strawberry hibiscus, tangerine, cucumber. When um, when the unicorn dropped by and uh, he was telling us about the flavor profiles, he would not give us a flavor card. He would not tell us what kind of flavors were in there. He was like, everything is mystery flavor. And um, the, the good thing about that was is when he was telling us it's mystery flavor, he was also saying every time you vape it, it tastes different. When you vape it indoors, it tastes different. When you vape it outside, it tastes different. The next time you clean your coils, it's going to taste different. And... He was fucking right. He was right. Every customer who picked up this liquid in my shop was like, this does taste different. It, this does taste different outside than it does inside. Now, I don't know if that's a mind fuck thing, because I think it is. With I the mean, placebo effect? Yeah, there's a placebo effect involved with this liquid. And uh, it, it's actually a really, really cool, uh, cool thing that people actually think it tastes different every time you stick it in your coils. And... With my personal experience so far, it's absolutely true. Once you get it in your head, that is going to be a different flavor every time, and it really works. So, um, all right, so we're going to uh, we're going to fill up our coils and tanks with this, and then uh, we'll be right back. Okay, uh, we are back. So we are all juiced up. We got cathedral, cathedral. We have cathedral. We have the cathedral. Uh, the cathedral redwood uh, juice in here by uh, Redwood Premium E Juice. What are you using today? I am using the Beacon Tube Mod. Yeah, that's a good device. Pretty solid. I like it so far. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's one of those older ones that's been out for a while, but uh, I remember when we had them in our shop, they were selling really good. And I'm, of course, using the uh, Space Invaders Box Mod again, custom box mod. All right. Yeah, it's good stuff. <laughs> Yeah, that's good. See, I had a uh, we uh, we had a house juice that was a cucumber uh, a long time ago. We had it, and it was my favorite. And this has a little hint of cucumber in it, and uh, the tangerine just enough kick um, because I didn't think you know like a hibiscus, tangerine, cucumber mixed in with the strawberries. You kind of read that and you go, I don't know if I'm gonna, I don't know if tangerine is gonna go with that. But you know, what do you think? I don't think the tangerine's overpowering, but it yeah. gives that nice little tang to it. <laughs> it gives a nice little tang. Did y'all hear that? She said tang, y'all. Um, just happy you didn't say poon before that. Uh, <laughs> you said that pee tang. Uh, so, yeah, this is uh, pretty good. 
Yeah, that's good stuff. That's really good. I like the the strawberry. The strawberry is more, I think, more pronounced more than anything. Is there one flavor that jumps out to you? I taste, yeah, the strawberry mm -hmm. and tangerine, but I don't really taste the cucumber. Don't taste the cucumber. See, I taste the cucumber, but maybe it's one of those things where it's in there, but you know, we're not gonna tell you it's in there. It's that secret flavor. That's yeah, a good I, potion. yeah. And see, the cucumber is supposed to have a, like a, a cooling effect uh, almost. So if you taste a little bit of the cooling, like I do, that's uh, that's the cucumber in there. So yeah, that's pretty good. Want to try it on another one? See if it gets the difference. Oh yeah. Okay. You want to do that? I think. Let me make sure it's. All nice. right. So we're gonna switch mods here. Ashley's gonna switch mods. She's gonna try it on something else, and then after that, we're gonna try the. Um, they got a new flavor called. Uh, it's called Eureka, and Eureka is a uh, mango. Like that's it. Like I, I got my menus here, and I was looking up like, what's the flavor profile on this uh, on this Eureka, and um, mango. That's it. There's no like, it's not a fancy like, oh, there's this, there's that undertones on the inhale on the exhale. No, no, no. mango. So that's the next one we're gonna try, but she's gonna head and uh, she's dripping that cathedral. Uh oh, uh oh, dry hit. Bam. You all right? You need, you need to take a time out. We're good. We're good. <laughs> I think there's still a lot of Lost Coast left in here. Yeah, I had still Lost Coast in here before. Out. Yeah. So does it taste? Does it taste better or worse with that, or does it taste better out of your dripper? I like it out of the dripper. But yeah. I Kind of just taste last coast in here. So. Yeah. All right. Well, we mixed two juices together, so that's not. Uh, yeah, we kind of fucked that up. Just take the little kinger thing out. You want me cut? You want me cut? All right, we're gonna make a cut. <laughs> all right, cut. Um, all right. So the next one we're gonna try is Eureka. Eureka. Of course, you hear I was talking about that was the mango. So uh, we're gonna juice up, and we'll be right back. All right, we're back, we're all juiced up. Uh, this is the uh, mango, uh, name of the flavor is Eureka. Let's go for it. I like it. Damn, <laughs> damn. Now, <laughs> I've been carrying this for maybe about a month, month and a half, never tried it yet. Um, my customers tried it at the shop, they said it was pretty good, and uh, yeah, they're pretty much right. Like Eureka, I found it. <coughs> yeah. Exclamation point. Yeah, there is, so, yeah. When on the bottles, it doesn't it doesn't just say Eureka, there's an exclamation on it, and um, yeah, that's right. That's like that's really good. And you know what? It doesn't need to have undertones, it doesn't need to have it's just it's just straight mango, but that's okay. Some people just want mango. Yeah, that's actually the best mango flavor I've ever had. It's very summery. Or summer yeah. it's like No, summary's summary is good. Yeah, summary. That's like you, you know, when you when, when you want to talk about something, <laughs> like say you want to talk about a movie, it's two and a half hours long. You're not gonna talk two and a half hours. We're gonna make a summary out of it. Is that what you mean? I guess <laughs> a summary. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's really good. And are you getting anything else, or it's just mango for you? Just straight mango. Yeah, just straight mango. That's what I'm getting too. Man, that's good. That's good. Sometimes you just need one flavor. You know, a lot of these flavors, like, oh, this one's, uh, this was chocolate banana with uh, graham cracker, and it's got uh, tree sap in it, and uh, fresh flowers. Like, fuck, get the fuck out of here. Hey, man, sometimes I just want an apple. Simple and to the point. Uh huh. Yeah, but sometimes you do want all that stuff, you know. It just depends on what kind of mood you're in. All right, so that one, um. I give it a thumbs up. Yeah. Two thumbs up. Two thumbs up? Two thumbs up. <laughs> Shoot. Man, if I had three thumbs, I'd give it two and a half thumbs. No, I'd give it three thumbs up. <laughs> yeah, that stuff's pretty good. All right, mango. Um, so let's see. The next one is going to be uh, Cathedral Black. So just like the original Cathedral, it's a little remix on that flavor, and that's going to come in this uh, pretty little uh, black and purple. Yeah, that's purple. Uh, Sacramento Kings colors. So, all right, we're going to juice that one up, or we're going to let you know what, what we think about it. Got anybody watching still? Oh, gosh. That was hot. Oh, you all right? <laughs> Uh-oh. Yep. Got a burnt? Just burnt touch arm. those, the metal. Oh, you know. no, that's no good. Good thing you're not supposed to touch. Yeah. There's a lot of things you're not supposed to touch. True. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> all right, so uh, <laughs> we're all juiced up. 
Uh, again, we're going with Cathedral Black. So this is a little remix of the uh, original Cathedral. Um, flavor profile, go for it. The blackberry version of the original Cathedral. All right, so it's the strawberry hibiscus tangerine cucumber with blackberry. Um, that's a lot of flavors. Yeah, it is. Now see, that's completely different than the mango one. I was like, yeah, it's just mango, that's great. This one's got like 20 flavors in it. And now, like, all right, maybe this is what I want. So, I mean, but if we like the original Cathedral, maybe a little blackberry shouldn't be too... Too bad. Mm-hmm. Hmm. That's better than the original. <clears throat> I was gonna say, I like that more than the original. I like the remix better. Just like in music, sometimes you like the remix better. You ever hear a song, you go, ah, oh, that song's pretty good. Then the remix comes out, you're like, fuck yeah. Fuck the original. Yeah, to see this cathedral? Man, fuck the original. It's still good. What's that? That blackberry? Oh, that's good. I like that a lot. Uh, I actually, I think I like that even better than the uh, the mango. The mango is bomb. What do you think? I just want to keep vaping it. Yeah? It's good. I like... You definitely get the blackberry more than anything. But you yeah. have like those undertones of like the hibiscus and... Now see, so, I, I'm kind of missing all the other flavors, but that blackberry comes out really good and uh, I haven't had too many blackberries that I've tried that I really loved because I personally don't like uh, blackberries. I just don't think they taste that good, but this what? is, it's good as a vape. Yeah, I'm not a blackberry fan. Are you? Yes, I love blackberries. I, and I hate the phones. Especially. Uh <laughs> old school. Yeah. So yeah, that's good, man. That's uh, that's Cathedral Black. All right, so we're gonna move on to the next flavor. The next flavor is going to be Cathedral Ice. So tell us a little bit about Cathedral Ice. It's the ice version of the original Cathedral. Yeah. So these guys basically uh, stuck to. They pretty much like stuck to one flavor, and they're like, let's get this flavor and remix it. Yeah, and if it works, it works. Go yeah. For it. So I already know I'm gonna like this Cathedral Ice because, uh, like I said in previous videos, I love uh, the menthol blast. Um, that's just one of my favorite things. So all right, we're gonna juice up these coils, and uh, we'll let you know what we think about it. Okay, so we're down to the last flavor in the line. Well, actually, I don't think it's the last flavor in the line. These are just the uh, the samples and the uh, the stuff that we have. So this one is Cathedral Iced. Of course, it's an iced version of the original Cathedral in the green bottle. And uh, I think I know I'm gonna like this, so let's try it out. <laughs> oh, it's icy! <coughs> oh, that feels good. <laughs> God, that feels good going down. It's like, I love the feeling of like the menthol. Yeah? Yeah, how did I hit, I hit you? Pretty good. It hit good. Yeah, I, I think it's. I think the. Uh, I think the ice is pretty strong in that one. Are you getting it, get it as strong? Well, you must be because you're using a, an RDA. Yeah, I definitely feel it. Yeah, yeah, that feels. It, it feels good. Now I'll tell you this: if you're not a fan of uh, menthol, or ice flavors, you're not gonna like it. You're not. That's just the truth. Um, but I love it. I love it. I love, I mean, like I said before in previous videos, you can put anything with menthol and I'll like, yeah. I'll, peanut I'm butter. Just, yeah, peanut butter, <laughs> menthol. You know what? You might have found one that I might not like. Yeah. It just doesn't sound appealing. It's like icy peanut butter. Oh, that's good. Oh, yeah. Not sure how I feel about that. Now, as much as I love ice, this isn't this isn't my favorite out of the line. I, I'm, I'm kind of fighting in between the mango and the blackberry, um, but I think the blackberry, the blackberry got me. Yeah, I think the blackberry takes the cake out of this line so far. But the uh, the ice, man, if you like if you like menthol, it's good. But if you don't like menthol, that's it. You're just not gonna like it. But you know. See, I get mostly menthol with like a hint of what's in Cathedral. Like yeah. The menthol almost takes over. I'm getting the menthol. I'm getting the cucumber. Tangerine for me is lost. Mm -hmm. um, the hibiscus. The hibiscus, anytime hibiscus is in a liquid, it's always kind of like a, a real subtle thing. You're not really supposed to taste hibiscus. It's more of like a, I don't even know how to explain it, but when it's in there, you can tell that there's something in there, but you never know it's hibiscus. And then the uh, strawberry, I get a very, very small, small, small hint of strawberry. To me, it's mostly cucumber ice. I get but strawberry you're, cucumber. You're getting strawberry cucumber? Yeah. Okay. 
It's an interesting combination if you think about it, but it actually tastes really good. Ooh, you know what else tastes good? Onion rings on cheeseburgers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but that's been a combo that a lot of people have known about for a while. I love my some onion rings on cheeseburgers. I get the little onion rings from Burger King. You know how they have the tinies? I haven't been to Burger King in like five years. Oh my god, you're missing out! <laughs> Yeah, Burger King little baby onion rings on their hamburgers uh, with a little barbecue sauce. The bomb. Sounds good. Yeah, that's icy. That is icy. So, um, yeah. So, all together as a line, what do you get it? What, what do you give it? Are, you want to start doing a rating system? We can do a rating system. All right. Um, Should we like... How many golden onion rings do you <laughs> give it? Huh? Out of how many? Out of how many? Uh, let's say we'll go up to we'll go up to uh, seven. Let's make it odd. Seven oh, golden so onion. If you get a seven, it's the max. So how many golden onion rings do you give it? I'd actually probably give it a five and a half, six golden onion rings. Five and a half, or six, so that's five and three quarters. Onion. So now now it sounds like a a star search. <laughs> he, he gets five and three quarter stars. All right, so five and three quarters. Uh yeah, I gotta say, um, out of a seven golden onion rings, I gotta give it a six and a quarter stars. It's almost perfect. Um, yeah, the uh, the flagship flavor, Cathedral, really good. Uh, the mango, best mango I've ever had. The blackberry is, to me, the standout of the group. And, of course, the, uh, the menthol. The menthol is really good, but if you don't like menthol, you ain't gonna like menthol. So, that's all there is to it. I changed my number. <laughs> oh, what would you change your number to? Change it to six. You, you're going up to six. I go up to six. All right, so it's five good. and a, five and three quarter stars goes up to a six, or it was a one quarter. Yeah. All right. Wait, I thought we so, were doing rings. Huh? Yeah. Well. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So six, uh, six and a quarter onion rings to six onion rings. That's a uh, twelve and a quarter out of a possible fourteen. So that's pretty fucking good. Um, so. These guys don't really have a website. They're a really small company right now. They're going out to shops like crazy, um, dropping off samples. Um, but if you see it in your shop or if your shop doesn't have it, tell them to get Redwood Premium E-Juice. This is not a commercial for Redwood. Um, I pay full price for it just like everyone else in my shop. It's just good stuff. It's really, really good. It's a good line for everyone to have. And um, they're popping up on, in, on Instagram everywhere. So yeah, it's good. I think we're done here. It's a, yeah, totally, totally a good line. And it comes in zero, three, and six milligrams as well. Yeah, I don't think they go up to 12. I, I think I asked for 12s before and they didn't have it. And um, they do have a few more flavors, uh, but these are these are like their flagship flavors right now. Of course, they got that Cathedral and just kind of remixed it a few times. So good stuff. We like it. I like so, it. And yeah. it doesn't taste artificial. No, uh-uh. It all tastes like actual... Yeah, it tastes what... From the, from the fruit juice. Yeah, it tastes what, it's like, <laughs> what it's supposed to taste like. So, all right, cool. I think that's it. That's our juice review. Very positive. Yeah. All right, cool. Give me a high five and you're allowed to talk. Oh, thank you. <laughs> See you guys. See you guys next Bye. time. Bye.